couple of ways that you can mark your tools, um, whether it be with marking your TTID, which is assigned to each tool, um, a visual code, can be written on in marker pen, can be engraved on. You could also etch, engrave it into your toolboxes. So we've etched that one and then filled it in with a uh, permanent marker to make that even more difficult to remove or scratch off. Um, you can also use uh, UV to mark your tools. Mark your tool. Here on our on our spirit level, we've actually put the UV inside the engraved, engraved mark there. Um, on a larger toolbox, we've actually stuck it in where the uh, where the handle is. Drills or, or smaller hand tools, easy enough to write write on. And yeah, they may rub off, but they're very easy to write on again. Now, if they are taken off, rubbed off, scratched off, whatever, um, this is where the tool like <coughs> tool taggers uh, NFC scanning comes in handy because we've got. NFC tags embedded in all of these tools. So we just go to our scan, pick NFC scan, pick a tool, pick a tool, scan over it. There we go, tags picked up. And as you can see straight away, this drill's been reported lost or stolen from Sussex Police, tool reference number, etc. Not just restricted to drills, our trusty old Stabilia. Um, spirit levels you can uh, mark these two and now in this case we've actually just put one in the end cap oh look that one's stolen too again this this is as long and as broad as you want to make it standard BL 1830 forever getting pinched oh that one's not been stolen look at that that's a result so I just want to show you uh, a tool over here that, that we've actually, you can see, we've rubbed off the markings, the visual markings. So we think that might be clean and ready to sell. Well, I've got news for you, mister, and it's all bad because that's a stolen tool. Don't have to go with tools. You can do your, your toolboxes too. So in this toolbox here, you've got a tag hidden inside. It's not hidden inside at the moment. It's actually... Oh, just stuck inside the toolbox there. It's a 20p tag. Now what we would suggest is you epoxy over that or glue a small piece of plastic over it to stop it being so easily removed. But again, anybody just... Oh, does help if it's back on. Run the tool over. There you go, you can also see that the box itself has been reported stolen. So you can have a different TTID and a different tag for absolutely every piece of equipment that you've got. So if they do get separated, you know which is yours and which isn't. As simple as that, chaps. Well, chap S's as well. 20, 20, 30, 50p tags inside your tools. Protect your tools.